Hi. Glad you're here. Yeah. God, it's been so long since we've talked. It's good that we finally got to catch up. Mm. So, how are you doing anyway? Uh, things have been better. Things have been worse, but uh, I mean, yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, yeah. Like when I think about it, I'm, I'm actually fine. <laughs> this tastes like shit. This really tastes like shit. I don't know why people smoke. So, since when did you smoke? Oh, well, this. I don't. I don't smoke. No, I literally, I don't smoke. Have you not seen the 2003 anthology film by Jim Jarmusch? Called Coffee and Cigarettes? Does it make sense now? I have not seen that film. Featuring Tom Waits and Iggy Pop, Kate Blanchett, but uh... You shouldn't expect me to have seen that film because I'm not I'm not a film buff like you. Anyway, I'm not actually a movie buff. Honesty is refreshing. I'm not really that into movies, even though I thought I was. Nice to hear you finally admit that you're not a movie buff because everyone can tell because you haven't even seen things like Titanic until two weeks ago, so you have? Oh, okay, well. There you go, guys. I'm a fraud. Long overdue, mate. <laughs> um, could you please get your feet off the table? It's like freaking me out a lot. Yeah, it's just unhygienic and gross. Okay, sorry. I'll take my feet off the table. Miss Princess. But it's nice that we can have our coffee with the support of our mother hackers. Yeah. At coffee.com slash Emmy Hacker. Yeah. <laughs> Are those seagulls dying? Shut the fuck up, seagull! Seagull, am I right? Yeah, I'm just stressed. Yeah. Because of many things. The neighbors are fucking loud, and I cannot hear myself think, and I cannot hear you, and I cannot imagine how shit it sounds on camera, and, uh, can't get home to New Zealand except I sort of don't really want to go back to New Zealand because I don't feel like I belong. I don't feel like I belong here. But then yeah, I guess. I just feel so fucking trapped and feel like a freaking hobo and living out of a suitcase, which is fine. I don't have any interests anymore. Everything is boring. I get angry at everyone I know. I hate all the movies out there. Not interested in anything. The neighbors are really freaking noisy, aren't they? <laughs> I need to live out in the country, I think. Next time, we're having a conversation indoors, okay? Everything's fine. Except for that. <laughs> There's bird shit on the fucking chair. I spilled my coffee. There's bird shit on the chair. My life is going to shit. I'm trying so hard to think of meaningful shit to make. 
but then all the meaningful, meaningful stuff on YouTube or Vimeo or whatever is so pretentious or boring. And I am not listening to a single thing she is saying because, oh my goodness, this this woman worries too much. And I see it all the time with everyone that everyone's just so stressed. Constantly stressed for no reason. Like, oh my god, can't people just chill out? Can't people just chill out, man? Sounds like you just need to chill out and you'll find your interests just by relaxing, you know? I get it, I get it that you're more chill than I am. And maybe I need to chill out a bit because I'm a little bit high strung sometimes. Worrying about the future literally does absolutely nothing to impact the future. All it does is bring the potential misery you'll have to the present. So you'll feel the misery that you may not necessarily feel in the future. Which is not very smart. I thought you were supposed to be smart. You're actually losing out on enjoying life. Here I am with my coffee and my self. Just being chill. Everyone's being fucking loud, so I'm gonna leave now. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna leave as well. Yeah. Nice to see you. Next time we'll be chatting indoors and hopefully hopefully you'll be chilling out more. Jesus. It's fucking noisy.